Japan is planning on releasing over 1 million metric tons of radioactive water into the Pacific Ocean. As you can imagine, this is concerning, because while most of the dangerous elements of the radioactive water can be removed, there's no technology that removes radioactive tritium, and releasing it into the water could have an unpredictable impact on marine life as it moves its way down the food chain and back into humans. Countries like South Korea have even banned seafood from waters near Fukushima until the water is tested, which is hurting the livelihood of many Japanese fishermen who have vocally opposed the plan. Japan and the International Atomic Energy Agency say that the contaminated water will be highly diluted and released slowly over decades, so the tritium levels would meet environmental safety regulations. But experts can't seem to decide how much of a risk this is, with the Canadian Nuclear Safety Commission stating that tritium itself is too weak to penetrate the skin, but can increase the risk of cancer if consumed in extremely large quantities. 